welcome to my channel. So today we're doing this summery luau wow look. If y'all want to see that, then keep on watching. Alright, and to start out this tutorial, I am taking the Becca Backlighting Primer. And I'm taking my L'Oreal 24 Hour Foundation, the Infallible Glow in the shade 204 Natural Buff. And I am taking the Eco Tools Skin Perfecting Foundation Brush here. And I'm taking the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in the shade Light Neutral. Just taking a damp beauty sponge here and just blending that out. And of course we need to set that, so I'm taking my NARS Translucent Crystal Light Reflecting Setting Powder here, which is lovely. I have been loving this. I do like pressed powder a lot because you can just take a little beauty sponge like that. And I know sometimes with loose powders, that is kind of just what they are. They're so loose that sometimes they just kind of get all over the place and you lose product. So I have just been trying a pressed powder for a little bit see how I like it and I really like this one I don't buy NARS too often but I'm just still kind of experimenting with the brand what I like what I don't like and this is definitely one of the things I do like and just taking a fluffy brush we are just taking that and just lightly setting that you don't need it as heavily pressed as like the under eye and the nose because we did put concealer there and here is just a light foundation and of course while that bakes I'm just taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Brad Finer in the shade dark brown Now that the brows are done, I'm just taking a fluffy brush and just wiping away any excess powder. And of course, I'm taking my Hoola Bronzer by Benefit. And we are going for a very contoured look here. Very bronzed, I should say. Now that we are all bronzed up, I am taking my Tarte Goddess Glam Eye and Cheek Palette and I am taking the blush shade here, Supreme. And for highlighter, I am taking the Anastasia Beverly Hills Amorezzi, in which I have been loving this. Look at that. So just taking a highlighting brush here. And this one is actually what I've been using a lot lately, which is the e.l.f. highlighting brush. You can get that at Target for a few dollars, and it is really, really good. And going back in with the Hoola bronzer and a little brush here, just contouring the sides of the nose. Taking my Ulta Beauty Tinted Eye Primer in the shade Satin Blush. Just taking a little dabble do you of that. And taking a fluffy brush and my Modern Renaissance Palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills. We are going to set it using the shade Golden Ochre. 
And we are going in with the shade Burnt Orange. We do want to stick to warmer colors here. And I'm going in with the shade Love Letter. I'm just taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Soft Glam Palette and I'm taking a slightly dampened flat brush here and going in with the shade Rose Pink. And to do the under eye, I'm just taking this small little brush here and going back in with the Modern Renaissance palette and going in with the shade Love Letter and putting that underneath the first, mm, I would say the first third. And then just go back in with your Soft Glam palette and go back in with the shade Rose Pink and fill in the inner two thirds. I'm just taking my NYX Matte Liquid Liner. I'm going to curl my lashes off camera and I'll be right back. Alrighty, so I curled my lashes off camera and I also put in my waterline the Marc Jacobs Highliner Pink of Me. So for mascara, I am just taking the Clinique High Impact Lash Elevating Mascara in the shade Black. <laughs> Alrighty, so off camera, I took some of the Nevia Lip Butter and Raspberry Rose Kiss to prime my lips. And as for mascara, I did two top coats and one bottom coat. And I am now just taking my Vivid Matte Liquid Lipstick from Maybelline in the shade Berry Boost. gorgeous color there. So now I'm just taking, of course, my peach blur blurring powder and a fluffy brush. And I'm taking my Ulta Beauty Dewy Makeup Setting Spray. And we are good. And that is it guys, I hope you all liked this luau wow look. If you did, please give it a big old thumbs up. Also don't forget to check out the awesome social media shout out down below. My social media links are down there as well. Love you guys, bye!